because it already touched it, I can't rule out that a low has been made actually. And in fact, we've been waiting. Oh, wow, I just see that now actually, because yesterday and the days before we talked about the $19.50 level. That's what just confused me because by yesterday it hadn't reached this um, level yet, but it now has, it touched it. And if we talk about Fibonacci extensions, remember what the first target typically is, which is the 61.8 extension. It's at $19.50 and you see that. Um, the 61.8 extension. So because it already touched it, I can't rule out that a low has been made actually. And in fact, we've been waiting. Oh, wow, I just see that now actually, because yesterday and the days before we talked about the $19.50 level, that's what just confused me because by yesterday it hadn't reached this um, level yet, but it now has, it touched it. It was the next relevant level to watch. And I highlighted that could be the next, if we get one more low, which was expected, which we got yesterday, um, this year, could end the entire correction. So, okay, so fair enough. So it might very much be that with this touch of the support level yesterday, the 61.8 extension at $19.50, the entire correction is over, but we of course need more evidence, need more proof. At the moment, I would still look at lower, um, also because I expect it for Bitcoin Ethereum as well. But again, you know, we've, we've done what we wanted to see, another low, 